Hi guys, so I'm currently at my door and I'm going to be showing you the Reborn Nursery Tour of 2017. So what you're seeing is pretty much the basis of my Reborn Nursery. Um, the other half of my room, so like from this half, is my room. And this room is divided between my room and the nursery because I pretty much have the nursery in my room. So actually opposite the door I have the carry cot and um, like a little seat where Paisley sits. The toddlers, um, I do now have a travel cot but I still prefer them down here because I don't know where my carry cot to go and it's nice to have someone in there and then this seat is just nice to put one of the toddlers on when it's not being used because it just is nice for storage and then I can have more babies actually in the travel cot. But um. So Ivy sleeps in the carry cot of the pram because she fits in there really nicely and then Paisley sits on like this really cute little tufty in my room and it's so cute. So currently on the floor I do have a pile of clothes which I need to put away. The clothes I've just bought and I made a haul in in my previous video uh, the other day, although I actually recorded it the same day. <laughs> um, but. Behind that there is a box which has all the baby shoes in, so like all the baby and toddler shoes in there. Um, and I need to put all those shoes that are on top away. I also actually have my flute stand on there but you can't see it because it's black and a black bin. And then I've got some hangers on the floor because I took some things off so I could put them away. Oh and I have a Charmander down there. He just lives with the babies. <laughs> So up on this top bit, I have this box which has stuff from me and Damien, so when we do like little things I can put things in there to remember certain days. Then I have a fox screen wipe for my tablet and um, phone. That's in there because it makes it look pretty and it's somewhere for it to fit. Then in here I have dummies that need to be magnetised. I have a lot of them. And then here I just have um, all my hand gels. I have like seven or eight in there I think. And then this one... I've got dummies that have still got the nipple on, along with a dummy clip, and they'll go in there. And here at the back, this one here at the back, this big one, has like all like bows in, like clippy bows, and then this one has all the scratch mitts in. So that's what I have up there. So we'll now do these drawers. This top one, these are pretty full, but this top one has like all the bibs. So the boys and girls bibs are all in there. Then this one's got like all hats and headbands. So there's headbands in there as well. These are pretty much all full drawers. <laughs> this one here has all the socks in. I have a lot of socks for the babies because I have boys and girls of different sizes. And then the bottom one under the blankets, which you can't see, under the blanket there actually has the dummies in. It's just it's got the blanket in and I need to put that somewhere. So that's why that's there. So next of all we have the chest of drawers. The top is nothing reborn related so I'm not going to do anything on that. But I do have the um, four drawers which have baby clothes in so I'll show you them now. So this top drawer has all of Noah, Kit and Pablo's um, clothes in. We have trousers, shorts, footed bottoms. These are both long sleeved and they're short sleeved tops for all the boys. This drawer is Liberty's drawer. We have her short sleeve tops, long sleeve tops, footed bottoms, skirts, like trousers and joggers, shorts and leggings in there. I need to sort out Autumn and Addy's drawer a bit. But their short sleeve tops are here, long sleeve tops are there, footed bottoms there, cardigans there, like leggings here, shorts, and then like most of the trousers are there, like trousers and joggers. And the toddler's drawer, which is mostly full because I have two big toddlers. So I've got long sleeve tops, short sleeve tops. These are all generally shorts, I think. Yeah, they're all shorts. So we've got like leggings and trousers all at the back. They just all fit at the back because it just makes it easier. So next to the chest of drawers, we actually have Autumn in her Moses basket. Um, I gave Autumn the Moses basket because she's an extremely special baby to me and um, for that reason I just wanted her to have a bit more luxury than the rest of the babies kind of and um, she just looks so sweet in it and 
ever since like I got her, she's been in the Moses basket, and I didn't want to take that off her. She has this really cute like Moses basket cover on, which says, "When I'm big, I want to be tall on it." But under there, she has a little blankie, and then her really cute sleeper on. But I don't want to disturb her too much because she's fast asleep. As you can see, she's completely fast asleep. But I did want to show you, she does have some toys on her um, Moses basket because I do like giving babies some toys, generally. So she has um, the um, car seat bar toy. Then she's got a toy here which our auntie JJ got her, which she's holding, which you can't really see. That hippo at the back is the one she came with. That one's from Ikea and it's just really weird but funny at the same time and then she also has a little stitch protecting her and that stitch my sister got me from comic con and i love it but it just sleep sleeps with her because she can fit down the bottom and it just sits at the end there and it's just so cute and then finally we have the piece de la resistance of my nursery and that is my new travel cot you guys haven't seen this before and i didn't tell you about it I wanted to make a package opening of it but it was so heavy and it took me forever to open it so I didn't and I tried vlogging that day but I lost all the um, footage on my phone so I wasn't able to like, do that but I will show, go into detail on what the babies and where the babies are and who's in here there is also a baby down there Kit is right under there because he's the only one who fits under there and then the other three are across, and then Pablo is on top, but I'll show you that now. So Pablo just sits, well, he sleeps on the changing table part, and has got a poo cushion at the back, because I thought that was funny. <laughs> and he's got a little blue bear, which is actually Noah's, but he stole it. And then his, um, Levy. And then he's just in here in his little bed, and he's so cute. He's like, what's going on? He's got beautiful brown eyes, as you can see now. But I love him to bits. I really love this um, travel cot because it's got some really cute toys. It came with a purple bunny, the orange bear, and then a blue elephant. And then I added the pepper pig because there's two girls in here. So, yeah. The three babies we have in here are Addy, Noah, and Liberty because they all look so cute and they all fit in here really nicely. They do have some toys behind them. They've got a fox which Damien got me, a cow and gate bear, then a lovey. They've each got their own loveys on them, as you can see. And then there's also like a little chicken in that corner and then a little book that our auntie Rhea got us. And I'll just show you where Kit is. You can see Kit's feet through here but it's really hard to show him because I can't get down there to actually show you. But he's just in there lying down asleep. I did forget to mention, under the travel cot I do have the... Um changing bag as well as the uh, baby carrier just because so I know where they are and then also under the Moses basket I've got a lot of their like changing stuff so I have their um, uh, what are they called flannels, burp cloths, there are some blankets down there cloth nappies, we've also got the um, portable changing table down there as well as like a um, nappy box which has like nappies that I want to keep in it. Under my bed I also have these two storage units and in this one I keep all my bottles as you can see as well as the baby girls tights because they just fit really nicely in that little corner. And then this container is full of nappies so I've got that all full of nappies and then they're full of nappies as well. And there's also some um what are they called like two like complete an emptied um, bags and nappies which are under there. So that was my nursery tour, uh, my nursery tour for 2017. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys all in the next video. If you have any video suggestions, please them in the, put them in the comments below because I'd love to know what you guys want to see more of. And if there's any specific baby you want to see more of, also put that in the comments below because I will do that for you guys. Bye everyone.